Hey, this is Gatorx, and yeah, opening up more Pokemon Scarlet Violet 151. This is the Alakazam EX box. I went ahead and cashed in my Target wallet that points, I guess you'd call them, that I built up, and I just went ahead and got this. So yeah, those rewards systems do work. So yeah, opening up this, I do like the smaller box of these. Uh, you know, since it doesn't have like the giant jumbo card. Apparently, yeah, we still are getting the products with the jumbo card, as you may have saw the Zapdos box. But let's go ahead and get this open and uh, take a look at everything inside. So taking a look at those promos, there's the Abra, there's the Kadabra, and there's the Alakazam EX. These are all actually cards that appear in the set. Uh, however, these are like the special, you know, the promo holo versions. The Alakazam is, you know, obviously it's an EX in there, but these are, uh, you know, a common and uncommon, but they've got that holo rarity now. So, you know, if you want to have that like boosted uh, rarity upgrade, but that's like a, just a good way to get the full evolution line there, and the Alakazam EX is pretty cool. But aside from those, got the four packs of 151, so uh, let's go ahead and open those up. First pack. And so let, let's let's see how things go. Uh, I don't know how long it would take to actually complete. Well, obviously there are some hollows, so I don't think I'll complete the 151 original Pokemon, but hey, we got a Weedle. Got a Zubat, revealing Echo once during your turn if this Pokemon is in the active spot. Uh, you may have your opponent reveal their hand. Interesting. Goldeen, Weep and Bell, Nidorino, or Nidorino. I say Nidorino and people always get mad at me. Uh, Executor, Graveler, Omastar. Oh gosh, a uh, reverse. Oh yeah, that's a reverse. That is some interesting art there. Oh, and it's actually, uh, oh, a reverse rare. Cool. Yeah, that is some interest. That is some really cool art. Uh, I got you know similar to the uh, the one beforehand. This is the big Lord Helix, Primordial Tentacles. As long as this Pokemon's in the active spot, your opponent's active Pokemon can't retreat. Ooh, so it just grabs right onto it. So the next reverse, a reverse a Drowsy chilling on the roof, and the Hollow. Oh, it's hard to come off. It might be something. Oh, it's just a regular Hollow, a Flareon, and with a Steel Energy in the back there. Next pack. So. Got that Porygon again. Real funny conversion four move there. Electabuzz, seen that before. The very happy coughing, seen that before. Tangula, reaching for an apple there. Dragonair, Seedra, Hikabuto, a reverse Dugong. Man, I love Dugong. I, I've started loving Dugong a lot more recently. A reverse Tangula, yet again, same pet, or looking for, looking for that apple again. And a regular hollow Vileplume. See so yeah, how that one I didn't. Oh, oh gosh, what's this ability? Full Blooming Energy, when you play this Pokemon from your hand to evolve one of your Pokemon during your turn, you may look at the top eight cards of your deck and attach any number of basic energy cards you find there to your Pokemon in any way you like. Ooh, that's a really interesting ability. Hmm. Eight cards, that's a pretty good pool. And uh, Psychic Energy to go along with it. They're, well, no, I, we, no, we didn't get any Psychics in that pack. Next pack. All right, so halfway through, Looking, uh, looking for some more stuff. Oh, that's a funny Lickitung. <laughs> that is some nice art. Lickitung, Lickitung always looks. Well, I mean, it's bald all the time. It looks, it looks funny. Pidgey, Poliwhirl, uh, Kakuna, an Onix, a Dragonair, Seedra. That looks familiar. Hitmonchan, Reverse. The the new Reverse is sometimes a it's a little hard to read the read the effects in certain lights. Uh, Counter-Attack is the ability if this Pokemon is in the active spot and is damaged by an attack from your opponent's Pokemon. Put three damage counters on the attacking Pokemon. Okay. Uh, oh gosh. Oh, there's something gold. <laughs> oh gosh, the Mew EX, the golden Mew EX in the second reverse slot. So there's still a, there's still a hollow behind this, but man, that looks so good and look at it yeah yeah it's, it's different pose obviously but the the mew that was taunting us on the front of every pack whoa that is that is lucky what's the ability uh once during your turn you may draw cards until you have three cards in your hand restart okay so you can go from an empty hand to three nice and genome hacking choose one of your opponent's active pokemon's attacks and use it as this attack okay so it just it's just like the full counter. Oh gosh, that is so, that is so gold. That looks so good. And right behind the Mew is, <laughs> oh gosh, how funny is that? Uh, yeah, okay, a Mew EX. And look at that. <laughs> gosh, that has to be the luckiest pack. <laughs> Those psychic energy behind it just for the, I mean, you know, that energy means nothing, but <laughs> just the fact that, wow, right all aligned right next to each other. <laughs> Well, I mean, yeah, we obviously see that. So, yeah, two Mew EXs already. 
So here's the final pack. All right, so I think the luck was already used up on that last pack, but let's see what's in this one here. Bulbasaur, Drowsy, chilling on the roof again, Dratini, Growlithe, a big air balloon, a Primeape, Fero, Reverse Onyx, a... <laughs> Alright, an illustration rare, Mr. Mime, oh gosh. Man, I... So, okay, so Mr. Mime, interesting Pokemon. Uh, I think I got like two of the regular hollows of this, but this of course is the illustration rare here. Let me try and really get close so you can see what's going on there. So this is a full scene. They're in the park, and they're playing chess in the park, but of course it's Mime Chess. So you, <laughs> you can't even really see it. Let's see. Yeah, there we go. I think that looks pretty good. Yeah, so it's two Mr. Mime playing, well, invisible chess in the park, and then someone's watching them. That is pretty funny. I, I, I love the concept of this, of this illustration rare. Yeah, I, I've come around to liking Mr. Mime, and right behind that is, is, is something that doesn't want to, doesn't want to show its face. Oh gosh, it looks, oh gosh, it looks like something here. Let me... <laughs> And there it is, Zapdos EX. Already got one of those from, uh, you know, as a promo for the for the other Zapdos EX box. So not the coolest EX you could get, but hey, it's still an EX. And hey, it's, you know, it's also different art there. So that's pretty neat and Dark Energy chilling in the back. So recapping all the pools from this, we got that hollow, or for the hollows, the Vile Plume and the Flareon. But right after that, uh, well, you know, it stops there. Those are the only hollows we picked or pulled. Got the promos of the Abracadabra, Alakazam, and then right into the actual big pools, which, oh boy, got some got some really good luck, I think, in the packs here. That illustration rare Mr. Mime, that's still that's still kind of stuck to the to the Zapdos EX right behind it, and that Mew EX, and that that gold Mew EX. So hey, that was quite the box. Very uh, had had quite a bit of a psychic Pokemon theme with the the Alakazam, the Mewtwo, or the Mew, the two Mew, and uh, the Mr. Mime. So, yeah, let me know if you've gotten this box, if your pulls have been great. Again, I might not be opening up much more of 151, I think, just uh, those two boxes, and I think I'm pretty content with, you know, just as far as collecting goes. I'm, I really like that Mr. Mime, though, but, like, oh, yeah, you can't you, you can't hate how that Mew, that extreme golden Mew. So, if you'd like to see more, uh, let me know in the comments. Um, there might be a few more card openings. I don't know how much more there'll be. Oh, shoot, we're getting a new set in, like... Uh, a few weeks, so maybe stick around for that. There'll be just a few things, maybe an elite trainer box at the most. But uh, anyway, if you enjoyed the content, leave a like, subscribe, all that cool stuff. This has been Gatorx. I'll catch you later.